Michael. Bob did okay. He got 65. Okay. We got to make 135. Let's you do guys it. are a pretty sharp team. We can do this. You ready? Ready. All right, let's remind everybody Bob's answers. 25 seconds on the clock, please. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Name something served along with the restaurant sandwich. Fries. Name something that's kept locked up. Money. Fill in the blank. Figure blank. Four. On a scale of one to 10, how much do you worry about money? 10. Name something specific that a manicurist might do to your nails. Follow them down. Come on. Yes! Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Michael, that was good, man. That's fine. That was good. We need 135 points. Name something served along with a restaurant sandwich. You said? Fries. Survey said? Hey, here we go. Come on. French fries was number one. <laughs> Name something that's kept locked up. You said? Money. Survey said? Hey, there we go. Come on. Good. Money was the number one answer. We're 72 points away. Fill in the blank. Figure blank. You said? Figure four. Survey said? Oh. Figure eight. Figure eight. Ah. Eight was the number one. Aye. We steal 72 points away. On a scale of one to 10, how much do you worry about money? You said? 10. Survey said? Oh, come on. Oh, come on. 10 was the number one answer. We're 24 points away from $20,000. Name something specific that a manicurist might do to your nails. You said? File them. Down. Survey said. Falling down was number one. Yes. Wow. All right, Big Dave. Yes, sir. Got a little bit of work to put in, but I think you can do it. Oh, I'm ready. We can get there. You need 138 points. Chandler got 62. All right. You ready? I'm ready. All right, let's remind everybody of Chandler's answers. 25 seconds on the clock, please. Here we go. Name something you hope a house guest doesn't turn on in the middle of the night. The radio. How many balls can a really good juggler juggle at one time? Five. Name the weekday when restaurants are least crowded. Wednesday. Name something people do to make their feet feel good. Massage. Name something that gets static electricity in it. Clothes. Come on, man. Come on, big man, let's go. Come on, Big Dave. Let's take a run at this thing, man. Name something you hope a house guest doesn't turn on in the middle of the night. You said... Don't turn on that radio in there. <laughs> Survey said... <laughs> TV. TV was the number one answer. How many balls can a really good juggler juggle at one time? You said... Five. Survey said... Five is the number one answer. Name the weekday when restaurants are least crowded. You said... Wednesday. Survey said... Good job. Monday. Monday was the number one answer. Name something people do to make their feet feel good. You said... Massage them. Survey said... You're almost there. Massage was the number one answer. We need 26 points. Name something that gets static electricity in it. You said... Clothes. Survey said... All right, Kyle, we need some points. Now, Mike got 60. Oh, man. You need 140. <laughs> you could do it, though. 
You ready? I'm ready. All right, let's remind everybody Mike's answers. 25 seconds on the clock, please. We asked 100 men, how long would you have to be lost before you ask for directions? An hour. Name a place everyone loves to go. Chuck E. Cheese. Name something you like to have on you at all times. Money. Name something a weatherman might lose in a hurricane. Uh, his umbrella. Name something parents need a lot of. Patience. Yeah. yeah. Get your oh, oh, That's what I'm talking about. Come on, Kyle. Woo! That's it. Is that good? Is that good? You got it, baby. That's yeah, a we asked 100 men, how long would you have to be lost before you asked for directions? You said, what hour? Survey said, Yes! One hour was the number Dude. one answer. Come on, Kyle. Name a place everyone loves to go. You said to <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese. I'm, I'm, I'm a dad, so I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I've been there before. <laughs> I couldn't wait to get out. <laughs> Survey said. There we yeah. go. Wow. Boom. The yeah. beach. The, the beach. beach was number one. That's all right. We go. need 93. Let's go, baby. Name Come something on, you guys. like to have on you yeah. at all times. You said. Money. Come yeah. on, 50. 50. Some money. Come on, Survey man. said. Yeah! There we go. Oh, Boom! Oh, 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 money and wallet was the number one answer. Oh, yeah. We're 54 away Come from on, the money. Come on, Name something a weatherman might lose in a hurricane. You said. <laughs> an umbrella. Come a on, survey baby. said. Yeah! Was the number one answer. <laughs> we need 13 <laughs> for 20,000. Name something parents need a lot of. Oh, it's it. And you said. It's it. Uh, they need patience. Come a on. Survey says. <laughs> What relation are you to Tina? He's my youngest brother. We need 141 points. Yes. Okay. But guess what, Nicole? You can do it. Okay. okay? All right, let's remind everybody of Keenan's answers. 25 seconds on the clock, please. You're on an airplane. The pilot says you're stuck on the runway for an hour. What do you reach for? My phone. Name a reason why someone might start sweating. In an interview. What hour of the day does Thanksgiving dinner start? Two o'clock. Uh-huh. Again. One o'clock. Which of the seven dwarfs' names best describes you? Sleepy. Name something you put on your hands. Lotion. Uh-huh. Try again. Uh, gloves. <laughs> All right. Come on, Nicole. You're on an airplane. The pilot says you're stuck on the runway for an hour. What do you reach for? You said? Your phone. Survey said? Yes! Phone was the number one answer. We need 100 points. Name a reason why someone might start sweating. You said? An interview. Survey said? Nervous and stress was the number one answer. What hour of the day does Thanksgiving dinner start? You said 1 p.m. Survey said 4 p.m. 4 p.m. We still need a bunch. Which of the seven dwarfs' names best describes you? You said sleepy. Survey said Happy. Happy was the number one answer. We need 38 points. Name something you put on your hands. You said gloves. We need a big one. Survey says. Let's go. 
Gloves and mittens was the number one answer. Man, darling. How'd she do, Steve? How'd she do? How'd she do? How'd my baby girl do? You, know, you, you might want to stop bouncing. Okay. You want me to just say, don't worry about it, and you're going to make it from there? You know what? Because you're going to give the best answers That's possible. It. That's it. That's what we're going to do. That's it. That's it. I'm going to try. I've never done that before. Can I try that? Can I not tell her how many points she needs? We are history making here, Yes. Steven. So let's get it done, Meg. Okay. That's the attitude. All right, all right. Here we go. You ready? <laughs> You ready? Mm -hmm. All right, cool. Let's remind everyone of Meg's answers. 25 seconds on the clock, please. On a scale of 1 to 10, how sloppy are your kisses? Seven. Name something you might buy where one size fits all. <clears throat> Pass. Name something people do in a hurry and later regret. Get married. Name a crisp vegetable. Uh, carrot. Name something in their bodies that people donate. Uh, kidneys. Name something you might buy where one size fits all. Um, socks. Yes! Yeah! I did the best I could, Stephen. Your best was pretty good. Okay. Let's turn it around. You needed 146 points. Oh, I did. <laughs> That's a lot of points. Okay. It's been done before, right? It's... <laughs> It's you did so before. much better than me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> On a scale of one to ten, how sloppy are your kisses? You said a seven. That's a lot of moisture. <laughs> Survey said <laughs> number one answer was one. Oh, what most sloppy. people dry kiss. Yeah, no That's fun. very boring. I, mm -hmm. Name something you might buy where one size fits all. You said. Socks, survey said. Woo! There you go. Socks. Socks was the number one answer. I said, name something people do in a hurry and later regret. You said, they get married. Survey said. Woo! Getting married was the number one answer. Very nice. I said, name a crisp vegetable. You said, a carrot. Survey said. was the number one answer. I said, name something in their bodies that people donate. You said, a kidney. By some miracle, if 49 people said that, you got money. Survey says, Your whole damn family gonna be on YouTube. This about to be on YouTube. I'm gonna end up oh on YouTube. Oh my dear gracious. <laughs>